Hi, this is Danny at an Enphase Training Development Lab. In this session, I'm going to review 10T and 3T battery wiring. Always refer to the latest battery installation guide. Over here is a IQ Battery 3T, and here is a Battery 10T. Each Enphase system is limited to a maximum of 4 10Ts or 12 3T battery units. You have several options on how to wire these batteries together. You can wire together up to two battery 10Ts or six of the 3T batteries in a single circuit, all daisy chained to one another. It's a parallel circuit and it's limited to a single 40 amp breaker. If you have more than two battery 10Ts or more than six of the 3T batteries, you'll need to assemble an external battery combiner. Well, first I'll demonstrate how you can wire several Enphase batteries together. You have several options. I'll remove the covers and show you the most basic option. Step in frame. One, two, three. And then we open up the junction box. Using an external junction box, you can parallel together battery circuits using appropriate splices. Here I'm showing wire nuts. Be sure to install these carefully and give each of them a tug test to ensure the wire is secure. If your junction box is outdoors, be sure to use wet rated wire nuts similar to these. You can see that one battery circuit enters here and the other battery circuit comes down here up into the conduit and then the combined battery circuit actually ends up heading back down that conduit to where it interconnects. Another option for splicing inside of a standard junction box is to use multi-tap connectors or insulated lugs. Make sure that you have a large enough junction box for these. Here, I have a six by six by four inch model. The connectors I'm showing here are indoors or dry environment versions. When outside for outdoor applications, be sure to use the wet rated models. A different concept is to use a small load center as shown here. Each battery circuit enters and lands on a breaker. And then the combined battery circuit leaves the subpanel here. Do not splice wires in the IQ battery's wiring terminals. Do not splice wires together inside the IQ battery's wiring area. When needed, use an external junction box or a subpanel. Do not connect loads or other non battery items to your battery wiring. We offer free sales, design, and installer training at Enphase University. And be sure to subscribe to Enphase training videos to see when we post new items. Thanks for watching.